Hey everybody, this is Steven Totillo, deputy editor of Kotaku.com, and I've got a game for you. This is called Crisis in the Gulf, and as far as I know, it's the only Xbox video game made based on the oil spill in the Gulf right now. Now, uh, we've got a DP logo here, which might make you think of something in an oil rig, but there is some text on the screen telling us that all logos or corporations appearing in this game are fictitious, and any resemblance to real corporations is purely coincidental. Of course, they don't really mean that. I'm going to press start to start this game. Oil rig explodes. We've got a little bit of explanatory text. I'm going to jump right in, and I'm actually going to shut up for a sec so we can hear a little bit of the theme song for this game. Alright, you get the idea. So, difficulty levels in the game go anything from low lawn mower oil leak up through Kuwait circa 1990. My controller vibrates the harder this difficulty level pointer is uh, pointing. We're going to go to Gulf Oil Crisis, which is a difficulty level you can only play if you pay the full price for this game, which is about a buck if I remember correctly. Here we go at the bottom, you'll see that there is, uh, well, oil pressure is building and the spill is about to begin. And I don't know what kind of game you were expecting, but uh, folks, this is a tower defense game. I've got a budget of money. I've got things like cannons. That was a cannon I just laid down. A torpedo. Of course, all these things might look exactly like submarines to you. And they shoot the blobs of oil coming out. Now, uh, this is not exactly a, a technique currently being used by the Coast Guard or BP. The explanatory text uh, hyping this game in Xbox Live suggests maybe this is a strategy that uh, the companies and government should try. But you're not putting a cap on this or anything. And then, yeah, the oil builds up, you shoot it. It's not exactly a ton of fun, uh, even for me who loves power defense games. But hey, at least they figured out a way to make a game out of the spill in the Gulf of Mexico. And well, let me draw your attention to one other element of this game the new sticker at the top. You don't get a lot of political commentary and downloadable Xbox games. Here you go. DP environmental scientist claimed that oil is already a chef component in whale blubber. And uh, I saw a Sarah Palin joke in there somewhere where they were talking about drill baby drill. Oh, here we go. Previous Republican vice presidential candidate insists that drill baby drill is still a good idea. Biting, inspired, political commentary. This is an Xbox Live indie game. This is not a game made by any major corporation. This is a game made by, uh, actually I'm not sure who made it, I'm sorry to say, but this is the kind of game that can go up on the service. It's peer reviewed, uh, gets on there by people who are making games through the XNA program, and uh, you can give it a shot yourself. Again, uh, you can get it for about a buck. If you look for it on Xbox Live in the indie game section, a free trial version is available as well, although you will not be able to play this difficulty level. And there you go, Crisis in the Gulf on your Xbox 360.